What's up everyone, in this video I'll show you how to IP subnet. Now this is the easiest method, this is probably the easiest method I know. So we're going to be subnetting IP version 4 subnet. So we'll start from the very basics if you guys don't know this already. If you can, you can just skip it a bit. Each IPv4 has four octets. Octet is like a box, four boxes four sections that can hold numbers, pretty much that. These numbers can range from 0 to 255, 0 being the network, 255 being obviously the broadcast. Well, we'll get into that later, you guys will understand that later. Anyways, so these numbers can range, so if you have a number of 256, unvalid, X, doesn't work. Anyways, each one of these has 8 bits inside. Bits, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then 8 here. Each of these bits represents a different number. That number is 128, that's 64, 32, 16, 8, 4, 2, 1. 8, there's 8 right here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Basically double. 1, 2, 4, 4 plus 4, 8, 8 plus 8, 16. It doubles each time. So let's say if someone wanted the number, what's 130 in binary? So you would see, does 130 fit in 128? Yes. Now you do 130 minus 128. That's 2. 2 can't fit into 64. 0. 0, 0, 0, 0. But it could fit into 2. 1 and then you have one left over, zero. So this would be in binary 130. If you want 131, change that to one. The last one to one, and you have 131. 131 now. Okay, so let's do an example right now. I'll make this chart again, 64. Let me just separate this. Hopefully you guys can read that. Anyways. So now, let me just try to get a nicer angle here. So now what you want to do is you have an IP address. So 173.26.10.1. This is your network or IP address, right, IP. And then your subnet mask is 255, 255.248.0. Now you're like, how do I solve that? Here's one way. Two, the weird number is 250, 248. That's the weird number. That's in the third octet, so you would focus on the third octet in the IP address. So a way to find your increments of your network is you can either do 256, that's like a magic number, minus 248, which would equal, as you can see right here, 248, let's rewrite that, 248, 8. That's your increment. Or you can just look at this chart, that's why I like this chart better, because if you have a subnet mask of, let's say, 2, 240, what's your increment? 16. You have a subnet mask of 254, increment of 2 instead of doing a whole subtraction. Okay, so now your first usable host will network first, last usable, and then your broadcast. So now you would do eight increments. So you start from zero, zero, eight, 16. I can already stop there, because what I'm looking is where can 10 fall under? So now you do zero, minus one, seven. Eight minus one of this is 15. 10 can fall under 10, 15. What this side means is network, this side means broadcast. So now your first, your network would be 173.26. Now you replace that 10, because it falls under in this, this is the first subnet, second subnet, third subnet, fourth subnet, fifth, sixth, if you keep going. So this is the third subnet, 
and the first, the network is 8. Dot 8 dot 0. Because the network is 0. The first usable is 173.26.8. Dot. Can't be 0 because that's network. 1. That's all. That's how simple it is. 173. See if maybe you guys are probably getting this right now. What's last? Last you can use is 15. I just rewrote that. You probably can't see it that well. 15 dot. Now, max value is 255. But remember, 255 is broadcast. So you can't use 255. You could use 255 if it was in the third octet. But on the last one, 255 would be broadcast, so it's 254, 1 minus. So 173.26.15.255 is your broadcast. That's it, you're done. Let's do one more example. I have them written down here. Uh, 8, 16, 24, 26. Okay, so another example is 20, that's 155. I got two minutes on my camera left, so let's try to hurry this up. 93.161 slash 26. What slash 26 means is there's 26 bits, and on the last bit, that's your increment. So now, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That's 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 24, 25, 26. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Now we all know this bit right here is 64. 64 is 192. Let me check our chart. 64 is 192. So now your subnet mask would be 255, 255, 255.192. Another way of writing it is 26. Okay, one minute left. So now your network would be 64, 0, 64, uh, 128, 192, 191, 127. Now you look, where does 161 fall under? 161 falls under here. So your network is 20.155.93.125. First, last, so 20, 155, 93, 20, 155, 93, 20.155, 93 broadcast. So now we're looking at the fourth octet, because the fourth octet's the weird one. So now your first one would be, can't be 128, because it's in the last octet, so it's 129. Now, your last one is 190, and your broadcast is 191 because it's your last one. So if you have any questions, just comment below and I will get to you guys. And I'll do another video explaining class A, B, and C subnetting. Thanks for watching. Peace.